today you people sit and download and you're missing so much good stuff of what was actually there and going and getting this vinyl album. It meant so much going into uh, the center of Copenhagen to this big record store that would get all the imports. Every weekend I would be in there spending my allowance. Every weekend. All my money went to buying vinyl. And uh, discovering new bands and they knew my style. The people in the shop said, you got to check this one out. And remember my arms from standing, because you had these two here, and you stood like this for so long. Listen to albums that I, oh, I couldn't hold it anymore. I could barely move the arm. Looking back, like one of the first, it was actually a, um, what are they called? Eight track. It's like big boxy thing that you push in and those eight tracks on it. And it was Kiss. I started getting all the Kiss, everything they ever did. Then it went to vinyl. For those of you who don't know vinyl, it's like this big thing where you put a needle on it. I was a record collector, so everything and anything metal, I would buy it and it was kind of like trial by fire. You know, I'd save every penny, you know, and if the album cover looked like it was something to do with whatnot, you know, so it was hit and miss. I know me and Jeff used to go to indie record stores, you know, and buy vinyl because that's what you bought back then. Black Metal came out and I bought it, you know, chronologically. I went back and got Welcome to Hell and, you know, all the little EPs that they did in between. Maiden was really big with EPs back then, too. And, it, and there used to be a thing called the Columbia Record House where you'd get 14 pieces of vinyl for a penny, you know. So I was, I, I think I was 14, so I had one for each year that I had lived. And I didn't know what I wanted, but I went into the heavy metal section and I, I think I started in the A's and, and got, uh, and Alice Cooper was in there at that time, but then got into the Black Sabbath when I got to the B's and then so on and so on. And I had all these vinyl pieces around my house when I was a, you know, when I was a teenager. And, and I think that's where it, it really, it really starts.